Well, it's another day here in Rocky. It's just another day, Thursday today. And I wanted to show you something I bought. It was the only one in the whole of the UK. And you could get it on other uh, sites like, um, what's it called again? I'll just, well, anyway, other shopping sites. Um, they, some were charging over $100 for it and then delivery as well being expensive. I got this very cheap and it is the only one for this price in the whole of UK. I couldn't find any more in UK. It's a box of spells with everything in it. A little booklet here. I don't use it, I just wanted, wanted it because it was rare. And the book has stuff in it. It's a little bookmark you get with it. Feathers. And um, it has spells in it from, oh, so old they are. It's written by Lucy Summers, so it's very old. And um, it has spells on the front cover. And uh, you get everything with it that goes in the book, like candle, incense. I'll just put this book there. just fits back in the little and um, fits back in there and this opens up and you've got scrolls with um, tied up in ribbon ribbons all different colors for certain spells which I won't be doing because I just collected it. I just thought it might be worth something later because they were selling it for over a hundred dollars. So, and a packet of small incense, um, still sealed. A medallion for protection. And candle hasn't been used purple fairly decent size all in purple tissue paper So I thought I'd just show you that. That's quite interesting, isn't it? To have a little box full of spell stuff. You can add extra stuff if you wanted to for your spells, but uh, I won't be doing that. I'll be keeping it original. And on the back, it's got what you get. The book. Candle, the red, what's that? Ribbons, and the medallion bookmark, and incense, I think that is. Incense and um, sparks. So all that comes in a neatly packaged little box and they sent it from the UK. I can't remember what I paid for. It was very cheap. It came to around, um, probably around $50 or up and they were 
that's with postage as well, and they were charging um, on other sites over a hundred dollars, hundred and forty, hundred and sixty, just for the box itself because it's so rare to get now. So that adds to my collection to leave for the kids for a bit of imagination for them with the other books, as well as jewelry and some money. And, um, Sony PlayStation games and um, things like that. Um, I don't really have a great deal, but um, I'm trying to be like every now and then I buy something for the jewelry box for them because they might want to sell it, make some money for themselves. So my son wants to keep this ring, he, my younger son, he likes that ring, the diamond one, it's a fairly decent size diamond, that's big, and that wide. Um, it looks small because of the uh, I don't know, it just looks small. But when you measure it up with your fingers, it's like, whoa, that's pretty. Um, you know, they've got jewellery and stuff like that and some fun things like my crowns and circlets. Um, my favourite so far is the um, shell crown and the feather one. Uh, I love looking at it because it has beautiful colours and it reminds me of the Native American style things and it just looks so nice. And um, so I thought I would share this box of spells. Little, the little box of spells. All you need to bring the power of magic into your life, Lucy Summers. So, so they're fairly big size, but not too big where you can put it away and keep it for a rainy day. One day you might feel like doing a spell or something and all the stuff is in it that I don't want to touch anything in it because I want to keep it original for uh, passing it on to my kids and it's up to them if they want to use it then, not me. So, I don't know, spells they say, witches were killed doing spells and if you didn't worship Jesus you were tortured and killed in Europe. And then again the Romans used to kill Christians and the Christians used to kill everyone. <laughs> It was like um, a horror time. And now in Australia, you can do whatever you want to buy spell books and not be questioned over it. Um, you're not judged over it anymore. And years ago, you were pretty well pointed out as you're different, you're doing this and that's not right and there's still have that going on. I just got a message and add. I wish I could turn off eBay from sending me uh, messages but um, I'll have to check that out, see what I can do to turn that off because I'm tired of getting messages. But, um, so anyway, in the background, I've got some water and bird sounds. And there's real birds flying past with making sounds. So anyway, I thought I'd better show you this. It wasn't much to show, but um, as well as my carnelian crystals, I've got about 27 of them, 30. Um, these were the, just a handful I picked just to sit next to me. 
while I was setting my hair. And they're quite nice, so I'll show you. And there's some fairly clear ones. And this is the fourth one. They look very lovely. They're like little cherries. That's what they look like. And um, they're very good for you, like if you have imagination for crystals and feel their energy like I do. Um, I can feel their energy and move them in my hands by themselves without touching them. So I have a strong sense of their uh, energy and uh, the energy I felt off these was um, strong, very strong. In the ancient times they used to bury their wealthy with carnelian. So now we all can get married with carnelian. So anyway, that's all for now. Um, just still there's a lot of troubled times in other countries. There's storms everywhere and floods and fires and so forth. Um, earthquakes. There's a lot of people suffering that earthquake in Libya. Very bad. I'll show you one of my crystals I brought out today. It's fairly clear, it's got inclusions in it. It's a polished crystal. And I brought that out today just for a bit of you know, I like to bring my old crystals out. I don't like to leave them sitting around and just bring the new ones out. So I bring the old ones out and these are fairly old. I've got about three or four of them. And um, yeah, um, I use them for healing. So anyway, that's all for now. And um, keep up the Reiki, but... Uh, I don't use mine because I don't know, it's just too powerful the way it appeared on the, the, um, this um, gold lotto ticket and the way it caused Louise a very bad headache. I told her today that um, I think it was the cause of her massive headache that made her lay in bed. Because her disease affects her brain, and she had a very bad headache. So it must have been getting into the brain to heal her, but she can't be healed. It's too dangerous for her. She would suffer more because it's right into her genetic makeup. She's born with it, it's her, with her DNA. So it's no sense in trying to help her. Maybe if she had like had a bit of pain or something, it's good for that sort of thing. But um, I wouldn't use it anymore on people because of what it did to her. So anyway, my hair's scraggly today. I'm wearing white opal. Hard to see it. It's um, hard to see the glitter unless you have a light on it. But it's white opal. Um, I bought that years ago off eBay a bit to, with um, 
Australian julep that was selling stuff on eBay. Um, I think it was Asian. And it was selling a lot of opal. So I bought a couple of carrot earrings. One, um, he called it black opal, but it looks dark blue to me. <laughs> and he called this fire opal, but it looks like white opal to me because it sparkles white opal when you shine the light on it. Not, um, uh, I don't know, they have funny names for things and uh, it doesn't really, it doesn't really matter anyway. This nice pair of earrings to go with my, with anything really. Just, the metal isn't anything special, but it hasn't tarnished. The ears, so it's still pretty good. And I put water on them now and again to keep them glittery because I put uh, water stone, they love water. So, anyway, that's all for now. And I love you all. And I hope if you have arthritis. If you're game enough to try my symbols, go right ahead. If not, try Reiki, which doesn't work on me, the Reiki with arthritis. Um, it did a little bit on the diabetes. Okay, I 